So while in high school, you should strive to at least reach the application level of learning. At this level, you are not simply recalling and understanding material, you are also seeking to apply it to other learning, to real life situations. In essence, you are seeking to make your learning more personal and usable. As previously stated, getting to this level is not easy. You have to actively engage yourself in learning. You have to be attentive in class and actually look for ways to connect the material to the real world. You have to take responsibility for your learning and actually practice learning this way. Now let's explore even higher levels of learning analysis, synthesis, and evaluation learning levels can be achieved during your high school years. However, they are essential elements of success in higher education. When students have learned at the analysis level, they are able to break concepts down to constituent parts, analyze their structure, and recognize inherent assumptions. This level of learning is indeed considered higher order. Intellectual activities associated with analysis level learning include analyzing, subdividing, identifying motives, and finding underlying structures. Students who learn at this level often use their experience and learning in other classes as they tackle new concepts. Though not routinely expected in high school, this learning level is required in some advanced undergraduate and most graduate programs. Let's say that in science class you are learning about the development of the microscope. You learn that one of the early microscopes was developed in Europe during the 17th century. You remember from your global history course that events of 17th century Europe were critical in shaping many concepts of the modern world. It therefore makes sense that this important scientific development occurred during this time period. You have started learning on the analysis level. The next level of learning after analysis is synthesis. At this level, students begin to create and discover original thoughts and concepts based upon their recall, understanding, analysis, and application of learned material. They are able to reorganize elements of concepts into new and logical patterns and structures. Intellectual activity associated with this level of learning include arranging, deducing, devising, rewriting, planning and presenting. This level of learning requires students to be fully engaged. Engagement may be enhanced by a true interest in or even passion for the subject matter. Let's say you are taking a U.S. history course. You decide or are assigned to create an interactive PowerPoint presentation that compares and contrasts the development of democracy concepts in the colonies and the social and political events in Europe. Such comparisons may not have been exactly presented in class. However, based on your current and previous learnings, you are ready to create this presentation. You are operating at the synthesis level. At the evaluation level, based upon a mastery of the lower levels, students are equipped with the ability to assess the worth of the material being learned. They are comfortable with challenging assumptions, arguing alternatives, and supporting alternate concepts. Intellectual activities associated with the evaluation level of learning include arguing, critiquing, defending, testing, and verifying. Students learning at this level do not automatically accept presented material and information simply because it is presented in a book or by a teacher. They actively seek ways to verify and test assumptions. They may even question their own assumptions and thus spur additional learning. 
By continuously evaluating and challenging, they set up a cycle of continuous and lifelong learning. So no matter what level, learning requires effort. Learning is an active and collaborative process. It occurs as a result of collaboration between you, your teachers, friends, family, and even seemingly insignificant personal events and experiences. Though we do it every day, learning is complex. The more we attend to it, the better we get at it.